Got to shoot it. Nice heads up play by Geary. Yep. Uh, former Arizona standout Reggie Geary is most known for his athletic play with the Cats, and now he is making a worldwide name for himself as a basketball coach. Good morning to you. I'm Paul Sikala. Yes, the official announcement was finally made, and Reggie Geary will be the next head coach for the Japanese National Basketball League's Mitsubishi Diamond Dolphins. And I caught up with him right here in Tucson, one on one. He wants to play defense. Reggie Geary is most remembered in Tucson for being a defensive stopper and overall team player for some highly successful Lute Olsen squads in the 1990s. It's always great to be back in Tucson. He also spent time with NBA teams such as the Cavaliers and Spurs. Well, Geary is fouled. But now Geary's leadership skills have taken him to the international level, the Far East, Japan. Japan's a great culture, a great people, uh, very respectful, and, uh, and they're, love, they're learning to love the game of basketball. So, you know, uh, Japan is just a great place. I advise everybody to go there at least once. And if you go during Japan's basketball season, you'll see Geary as the new bench boss for the Mitsubishi Diamond Dolphins, just made official. He previously coached the Chiba Jets to the postseason last year. And in the 2011-2012 season, Geary led his Yokohama squad to a league title and was coach of the year. Yeah, the, the last four years I've been coaching professionally in Japan and uh, over there 10 months here in Tucson, two months. And just uh, you know, to have that great experience for my family is phenomenal. But then to come back to Tucson to see uh, friends, friends and family again is great. Great to see his sons also playing some b-ball alongside Tucson friends. Gary tells me if you do go to Japan one day. And just be careful, the food is very, very good. Tantalizingly tasty, I'm sure, but Tucson also tempts the tummy as well when it comes to our grub. So I couldn't resist the question. You probably missed the Sonoran style Mexican food as well, right? Oh, big yeah. time, big time. You know, we're dreaming about Mexican food the whole time <laughs> we're there and, and can't wait to get back. And so, uh, you know, those are our first stops. Back in the old Pueblo for a former basketball star that like many others who work in other parts, still calls Tucson home. It's a special place in our heart. Bear down, congrats again, my friend. Good to see you back in town before returning to Japan. All right, on to the NHL Finals Game 1. The Chicago Blackhawks and Tampa Bay Lightning matched up in a showdown scene right here on KVOA. Let's pick things up in the third period. 1-1, one, one, no score. Any more? Antoine Verme will smack in the game winner. Check it out again. Top shelf. The Blackhawks win 2-1. In baseball, the D-backs took on the Braves in the fifth we go. Can A.J. Pollock come through? Let me see. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Look at that ball go. That answers that. Arizona comes back from a five-run deficit to win. 9-8. Mark Trumbo was dealt to Seattle in a multi-year trade, or multi-player rather, trade to the Mariners. That's it for now. I'm Paul Sikala for News 4 Tucson Sports. Have a positive, productive day filled with lots of joy.